Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel where I create magical, nerdy and weird things. This time we're gonna take a look at this box of aqua markers that I got in our country version of Dollar Store. It is a pack of 24 markers with chisel tip and bullet tip. Update, 23 colors, one of the blues is doubled. Oh well, let's watch them. Well, this one is not completely inserted in the marker and I think it's not the only one. Some of the colors are pretty similar on the paper when I put them down. I mean, one of the blues is doubled anyway, so... I'm using this Strathmore Mixed Media sketchbook, the one with 190 GSM. So really smooth surface and the markers are still scratching on it. quickly swatch these markers and test them how I can use them with water because I'm usually using any water media, water-based media as a companion to my watercolors so I want to see how I can pick the pigment up with wet brush As you can see, with wet brush I can nudge some of the colors around pretty well and some of them are like, permanently stuck on the paper. Also when I put water on some of the markers, you can see tiny small bits of paper just kind of peeling off, like the, the marker scrape it off and then when I put water on they just like, dissolve the top piece of the paper off which is weird. I mean, this is not watercolor paper, it's mixed media, but it's still handling water pretty good in, in my previous tests, so I'm kind of confused if this is a thing that is specific for these markers or something. that everything is swatched and I know how the markers are behaving, I'm gonna make this simple sketch of a part of my house where I'm gonna create my future studio. The sketch is gonna be messy because the markers and I think skill issue is pretty important here. I mean, if you really wanna have a set of double-sided aqua markers, I think there's not much to choose from, so I guess for this is okay. I saw people use them as like uh, highlighters, but if you really want to have better quality markers and if you really want some cheap markers that are behaving really well, that are really good quality, just use Crayola super tips or something. I mean, I'm gonna use them up anyway. Have fun watching me drawing and see you next time. Oh, I almost forgot. If you want to see more of the weird art videos that I create, consider subscribing or sharing the video if you like it and I will see you next time in uh, next weird video. Have a magical day. Bye!